Good morning, Hushman Vikings. Buenos dias. I'm the student who had a great first day back, Mariah. And I'm the teacher who's back, Mr. Hesser. Today is Tuesday, October 18, 2022. Today is a white day, so students, you're heading to your 2B class. And be on time. Now it's time for harshment happenings. What's happening? We had our quarter one PBIS challenge, which was centered around timeliness. Um, we awarded a few different classes based on their timeliness. This was separate from what the Bonner Center did. Uh, but we had some similar winners. So we had Ms. Parabach, Mr. Skiles, Ms. Peterson's class, who were all recognized that Friday before break with a pizza party. What? What's your favorite pizza? Papa John's. Okay, Papa John's is okay. I'm like, I'm a Pizza Hut person. I know it makes me bad, but I'm like, when it comes to chains, I really love Pizza Hut. Now it's time for... Trivia Tuesday. Today's question is so interesting to me. What chicken franchise launched a chicken-flavored nail polish? What? I'll give you an option to look at the different potential answers. And the answer is... B. Back in 2016, KFC launched a chicken-flavored nail polish in different Asian markets, and the nail polish was like, whatever, uh, but it did a lot for their marketing at the time, because everyone was talking about this chicken-flavored nail polish. That's so weird. Honestly, I, like, I wouldn't necessarily wear it, but I would, I would want to have it. Does that make sense? It doesn't make sense. Now it's time for sports. Sports go sports! I know that cheerleading starts today, so students, be sure to talk to Ms. Thomas or Ms. Hymanson about cheerleading, which I think starts this week. If I'm wrong, I apologize. And then also, you know, make sure that you're keeping up with all of the Harshman games and sports that are about to start happening now that we're in quarter two. Now it's time for Before You Go, Stay in the Note. We've all heard of life hacks before, whether it's the best way to cut a cantaloupe or best way to pack for a 48-hour trip. But a group of neuroscientists have been publishing brain hacks specifically about ways to promote development within the brain. One of their hacks is deep breathing. So we've all been told, you know, when you're frustrated or if you're stressed out, that deep breathing can help. Uh, but what these neuroscientists are saying is that actually deep breathing helps all the time. And that taking time to deep breathing, whether it's, you know, through yoga or meditation or just sitting here right now watching announcements and taking a few deep breaths, all of those actually promote brain development and growth and sets your brain up to be able to more easily make connections. So I'll just sit and take these breaths and pause. I learned. I don't think that's quite how that works, but it's, you know, the general idea. You'll get smarter by taking deep breaths in the long run. That's the news for now. Make it a terrific Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs>